Well, now to the controversy over sexuality and faith. A major conference at Focus on the Family today teaches people how to overcome homosexuality. It's called Love One Out. As News First, David Talkin reports some say it works, others call it dangerous. Preventing homosexuality through faith. It's a movement that drew 900 people to focus on the family. And Jeff Johnston is one of the success stories. Just as there are many ways into homosexuality, there's a lot of different ways out. He says he used to be gay. And years ago, a conference similar to this one started him on a journey to heal his homosexuality. Gradually, God began to change my same-sex attractions, and I found myself more attracted to women. He's married now, has three children, and he shares his story at the Love One Out conference. The hope is that others, using faith, can follow his example. I know lots of people that have come out of homosexuality. But Daniel Gonzalez doesn't agree. He tried to change, even met with a nationally known author and counselor. I spent a year and a half in ex-gay therapy with Dr. Joseph Nicolosi, who's actually spoken at previous Love One Out events. He says, from personal experience, it doesn't work. Ultimately, I came to the realization that, that I had only convinced myself that I was becoming straight. So he and a group of ex-gay survivors, as they call themselves, had their own conference today. They claim this therapy is unhealthy, and that's a message they brought in protest to the gates of focus on the family. They want people to hear both sides. Do they realistically expect that we should live the rest of our lives without ever experiencing a meaningful romantic relationship? What do you do when x therapy doesn't work? In Colorado Springs, David Taukin, News First, Southern Colorado's news leader. This is the 10th year of the Love One Out Conference. Focus on the Family has hosted it all over the country and the world.